Hi, I'm Cindy. Hello, I am Barb. She's my little sister. My from baby, Minnesota. My baby sister from yes. Minnesota. She's sitting in for Debbie tonight. We had so many videos to do and Debbie just says, I need a break. No, she just needed to make some hot chocolate in the kitchen. Yes. Well, anyway, it was Haute Cash Week this week at Torrid. And Barb, who doesn't need to shop at Torrid, because she's way under the sizes that they have, but she was but kind enough. I love enough. the clothes. I wish they would have had my size. Right? I would have got some. They should have like a separate Torrid store for the smaller sizes. Mm -hmm. But anyway, so she came with and... Um, was very patient while we were trying on clothes. So the accessories were really cute. Yes. So she is she's very opinionated and is not afraid to share, like my sister Deb, as you all know. Good and bad. So I'm gonna make this quick because there's a lot of items, because it is hot cash, and I had a ton of hot cash. So the first top that I got, and jump in at any time, Barb, because I don't think she liked this shirt. So here's this first top, and I'm not typically a black and gray. Now I know Debbie was sitting here. She, she would love, love this. Yeah. But isn't this cute? It's got the lace in the front, and then it has the little lace back in the back with the little keyhole. Why don't you like this? I hate the cut on your on the neck here. Comes in turn, far. Turn, face the camera. Oh, a little. I'm yeah. sorry. Like so, what was came wrong? In, it came in too far on you. Oh, and it and showed it, all my bra fat. No, it's just a weird cut because your shoulders aren't real broad. Right no, here. I have very narrow so shoulders. So it really, it kind of made you look like you needed, you know. Oh, really? Yeah, therapy or something. But the I'm not big on the lace thing, especially at our I age. I love lace. But I just think lace ages us if it's not done well. But you know, I tried these on in the dressing room, and I know and it looks the different in the dressing room. probably wasn't real good in the dressing room. And then when you look at yourself on video with mm -hmm. the clothes, it looks completely different. Now, I have not seen the video of me trying it on. You guys just saw it, but I did not see it. So what do you think of this? Barb does not like this at all, and I got it just to incorporate more black and gray into my wardrobe. I'd like to see you in a different print then. That's, there's a lot going on in that. Okay, well that's a nay nay. From all right, maybe she'll like this top a little bit better. This isn't this. Look, I'm trying to incorporate some darker colors for fall, but I really liked this top. I'm not one to show my arms because you know, ugh. But <laughs> <laughs> now she is eight years younger than me, so maybe her fashion sense is a little different. But I like this top. Look at the back. It had this really cute little keyhole. Oh, it's, yeah, I think this did hang real nice on you when you had it on. Yeah, and this has, it's a knit top, but it wasn't too clingy, and I liked how blousey it was. Mm -hmm. And so because of the cut, it'll look really nice in the fall with, like, a sweater. But in a the summer, if I was yeah. around the house, I could just not, you know. That would look nice with a cardigan that doesn't button. Right, like a mustard-colored yeah. cardigan. Wouldn't that look nice? Uh-huh. So, all right, I found something she likes. Even like a gray cardigan, just to kind of... Yeah, it. all right. Okay, now let's see what she thinks about this one. Isn't this one cute? I'll put all the links to the clothing below if you like them. Mm -hmm. But this is a button-down top, and it had like a, mm -hmm. like a, a high waist, and it was long-sleeved. I actually love the stripes, mm -hmm. and I love the way the stripes are going the other way on the sleeve. On the cuff? Yeah, and I just wish it would have been <clears throat> a little bit bigger through this area. Yeah, well, when I tried it on the dressing room, I didn't realize it, but then when I got home, it was really tight here. And then I did notice on the back, I don't like how, and I didn't see this in the dressing room, but I don't like how the stripes don't match up. Yeah, and that's probably there. the style. It's probably the style for the yoke or whatever. I don't know. And then in the video that you watched of me trying it on, Barb's trying to adjust the high waist on me and stuff. And if, if I have to do that much to make a shirt look good on me, no, that one's going back. Yeah, but I love the color. It looked great you. in the dressing room, so I don't know what happened from the drive from the store to here. So I just love the the color on you. Yeah, I do too. That plum color I looks do too. good on you. Okay, 
Here's another Debbie shirt, and I don't think Barb liked this one either. But again, it's gray, but I'm trying to get some gray in for the upcoming fall. Anyway, isn't this pretty? Look at, it's got a really pretty, <laughs> it's got a really pretty lace front. And a really Have you guys pretty... ever seen that show, One Calls the Heart or something? Debbie or... watches it all the time. Yeah, that was from that time frame. Oh, look at it. Yeah. It's long, so I can wear leggings. And see how it, it's got that shark bite hem, but not so exaggerated, because I don't like the really exaggerated shark bite hem. She doesn't like it. No, I don't like that shirt. I could just be me. I'm from Minnesota. But I just what does don't that like, got to do with it? I don't like how high the neck is. I don't like again. It kind of looks like a, a very conservative wedding dress. Is, I'm, that's what it looks like to me. All right, weigh in, guys, on this shirt too, please. <laughs> maybe I maybe I'm not seeing. She things looks right. great in the shirt. I don't like the shirt, but she looks great. You don't have to be nice, because if they tell me take it back, I'm taking it back. Because again, this is like a trunk club, but mm -hmm. I don't have a time limit to get yeah. it back. All right, here's another shirt. Uh, and this one is... I actually love the shirt. Isn't it cute? Yeah. It's got that t-shirt material top with mm -hmm. a little bit gathered in the front. It's a little bit low. I might wear a, a cami underneath it. Look nice with a crisscross cami. Yeah, mm -hmm. something like that. Yeah. But it's again, it's got a high waistline that sits right underneath the boob, so that's kind of flattering for me with a little bit of it a would flare look nice out. With a shorter jean jacket because of this blue in it. Yeah. It'd be really cute. Yeah, or what do you guys jacket? think? I think it's really cute. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I did get a red jean jacket, which you guys are going to see. In fact, I'll show you that now. I have always wanted a red jean jacket, and I never see them anywhere. Look, Torrid has them. Look at it, and it's really nice quality. It'll so be great cute. for the fall. I think it's a little heavy for the summer, unless it's like at night or yeah. something. Mm -hmm. But isn't this gorgeous? I love it. Yeah, and it's not a crop style. It's a little bit mm -hmm. shorter jacket, but not too crop. I and again, was it so hits you in just the right place. Right, though, to exactly. Have a heavy jacket. So you guys, this it, this is awesome. I was so excited, and they got a whole line with this. They've got a jean skirt. So maybe you guys can it. say, is the red jean jacket better for Cindy or the red lipstick she tried earlier better for Cindy? Oh, yeah, that was in another <laughs> video. It's like crazy, oh. crazy colors. All right, so I know I'm definitely keeping that. And it's then cute. this was on clearance, which I just picked up. Isn't this just the cutest little jacket for summer? It's got three-quarter length sleeve. I liked it cuffed a little bit better because there's not much to it. But it's a little bit shorter jacket. It's like a khaki and white striped. I don't think Barb liked this one either. <laughs> what? Show well, your face. You could, you could wear it with the pink pants that we're not keeping, right? The pink pants? Oh, no, that was from a different group. That was from a different box. This... Well, I just, you know, do you ever remember back in the day in a hospital when the person would push the cart? The candy pass? stripers, that's what it reminds you of? I, for some reason, it does. Sorry. Does it look like that on me, you guys? Am I just see? Because I like the colors together. Is she right? Probably right. not. But that's just well, let me know what you guys think of this on me because I really thought it looked like a really cute summer blazer. I just think it's way too old, shapeless, cat. or just too gender neutral. <laughs> I don't know. All right, I need some help. You <laughs> let me know who you think is right on that. Now, I don't know what I was thinking in the store. This I dress. I think she probably did a little meth or crack before she tried no. this one on. Look, I love the print of this longer dress. Look at it. It's gorgeous. I don't know what I was thinking. Look at it on me, you guys. It's so low cut and tight. <laughs> There's so much going on. And <laughs> then you got the spaghetti straps with these things going off the side. And it's so busy up there. It makes there. it look like she got dressed really fast and forgot to finish. I don't know what I saw in this. You know what I saw? I am a sucker for this color. I'm well, a sucker for the flowers. the bottom looks great. The way it flows and kind of moves when you move too, but... The top is just, they forgot to finish that dress, I think. I, it, yeah, it didn't, 
I'm telling you, they, they mess with those lights in there and it looked completely different on. And when I put it on and the look on her and Debbie's face. So, well, the look on her face when she put it on well, and walked all out. All of a sudden, I'm like popping out over it and there's like. Yeah. <sighs> no. All right. Now. I love this print. It reminds me of a fall print, which is probably why I gravitated towards it. This is a wrap skirt where the front is a little bit shorter. Mm -hmm. It's like a midi length mm -hmm. and the back is a maxi. And look everybody, there's butterflies in it. And it's like a cross skirt so that you tie it and then it becomes a midi skirt in front and a maxi skirt behind. But look everyone, there's butterflies in it. Isn't that the prettiest print? Mm -hmm. Barb didn't like this skirt. Mm -hmm. Again, why? No. Because it's a little house on the prairie type skirt. You know, I just think it's her style. <laughs> I just think it's her style. I just, I don't know. You know, she's in a t-shirt and jeans all the time. And I think I'd probably like it if there was, if it wasn't so heavy on the bottom. Oh, you think there's too much? I felt like much? it was real heavy on the bottom. Well, it does have much. that ruffle on the bottom, yeah. so maybe that's what it a was. A straight skirt, a little bit shorter, would have been great. All right, what do you guys think of this? Should I take this skirt back or keep it? Because I really like it. Because I think it would look really cool with a pale orange sweater, like cardigan, or like an olive green. I've got a lot of olive green. No. <laughs> Mom says She's I can't keep it. <laughs> She's trying so hard, and I think she likes butterflies a lot, and I do too, but I would probably see that hanging in, like, a house in the 70s in the kitchen or the bathroom hey, hey. as curtains. All right. That's just me, though. I have another dress. We're going to try and wrap this up within 15 minutes. we got three minutes to go. Look at this dress. I wish I would have got it for 4th of July. It. Look oh, at this I love print. That dress all the time. It's so cute. Yeah, it's kind of flowy on the bottom. And it's got the seersucker elastic on the top. I would love and to wear this dress in Minnesota with a jean jacket and a pair of cowboy boots. Red jean jacket, right? No, I'd wear brown cowboy boots and a blue jean jacket. Well, yeah, you can do that too, but I just bought a red jean jacket. Oh, you could wear the red one with that. Isn't yeah. this just so pretty? And it's that rayon material and it just flows. I know it wrinkles easy, but... Ooh, with like a pair of uh, strappy wedge sandals. And you can so wear cute. like, um, when, it, when it gets fall, to try and keep it a little bit warmer. Like in my video, I have on like black mm -hmm. uh, leggings. I so would you like can to wear see little... some jeggings with it instead. Yeah. Isn't this pretty? This is a keeper. I don't care if she likes it or not. Mm -hmm. All right. I love Last that one. Last but not least, again, this is, what was I thinking? I like that shirt a lot. All right. I love lavender. I don't think it looks very good on me though. And maybe that's in the I think dressing the shade room. Is okay. Yeah, you think so? What do you guys think? It kind of is gathered and has that ribbing there in the front. Well, she gets her little cutesy look she likes with this. I up like here. ruffles and lace. Ruffles and lace. And this is even though it comes in at the top, don't you think it actually flatters her a little bit, then takes away from this part, so I don't know. So this is kind of iffy. Let me know what you guys think. So wasn't that a great haul? I think I spent $167, I think, on, I don't know, all those clothes. 15 minutes worth of show when you close. So, and I still have some Hope Cash left, which I'm trying to give to Debbie so she can get a few things that she needs. But all right. Well, thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoy. I'll put all the links below if you guys want to go take a look at any of them, if any of them suits your fancy. Yeah, and you can either say that your sister is full of it or actually... Yeah. Does she know what she's talking about? Should I keep the stuff she was like? Or is it just me? You know, maybe I was tired when I was in the dressing room and just wanted to leave. I don't know, so... All right, hit that subscribe button. It's down there. Barb will show you right there by her elbow. We, uh, my well, husband actually watches their videos. Say hi, Scott. Hi, Scott in Minnesota. And whoever comes to visit on video filming night is in our video. I get to sit in. Yeah. All right, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Good night, ladies. Night. Bye.